patients with MPS6, even the ones treated with enzyme replacement therapy, they still have uh, uh, significant uh, unmet needs. They, they still experience pain, uh, joint restriction, and some uh, manifestations related to inflammation. They have uh, significant uh, uh, improvement with enzyme replacement therapy, but uh, uh, some burden still remains, and this needs to be uh, addressed. So, what we are now trying is to is explore the, the use of a, um, another molecule, the pentosan polysulfate, that uh, can uh, address this uh, pain and inflammation and uh, improve the quality of life of patients of, with MPS6. So, we are conducting a clinical trial uh, using this drug that is used as a a subcutaneous injection every week, and uh, we will uh, check if this, if the use of this drug, in addition to the enzyme replacement therapy, provides further benefits. Well, we presented the, how this uh, clinical trial is designed and how it's going on. We are still enrolling patients, and uh, we intend to complete enrollment. Uh, quite soon, and then uh, the study will run for 20, uh, 26 weeks, and uh, then we will have a, a uh, we'll analyze the data and uh, we'll have an idea about the the, effi the if the drug is safe and if the drug has efficacy of, to treat these uh, manifestations of MPS6 that remain despite uh, enzyme replacement therapy in many many patients. This, this uh, product, the pentosan polysulfate, was already tested in MPS1. The results were quite encouraging. Now it's being tested in MPS6 and probably it may work for uh, other types of MPS as well.